In more local news, a local hospital is now working to address a need that was a big part of a recent walkout. Now, nurses at Mercy Hospital went on strike for weeks late last year, and they fought for higher wages in their new contract, but also for more staff to reduce the burden on the people who work there. Now, the hospital is getting ready to talk to job applicants. Prospective nurses looking to step into their nursing careers can plan ahead for Wednesday's hiring event hosted by Catholic Health. Buffalo River Works will be the hub for an on-the-spot hiring event for nurses, nurse assistants, and immediate treatment assistants. It really focuses on nursing students. It's a great opportunity for students to get their foot in the door. Um, and really start their career with us well, as they're going through nursing school. Those looking for roles are asked to fill out a short application at chsbuffalo.org slash riverworks. The event will take place from 4 to 7 p.m. Appointments are preferred, but walk-ins are also welcome to fill jobs at Mercy Hospital. But right upstairs, we will have the open interviews. We'll have individuals to greet them. There will be a waiting area. They can sit down, meet with a hiring manager. And then if they have the requirements, if they meet the requirements of the job, they'll come right over to my team. We'll give them an on the spot offer and get them on their way. The hiring event comes at a time when the hospital workforce nationwide has dipped by about 90,000 people since the start of the pandemic in March of 2020. That's according to preliminary November data from the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics. Last fall, as part of the deal to end a strike by the CWA, Catholic Health agreed to hire more than 250 workers to address staffing shortages. Catholic Health's website for Mercy Hospital lists nearly 230 positions. About 120 of those are for registered registered nurses. Healthcare in general, right? There is a national shortage right now and Catholic Health is trying to do everything we can to bring individuals into our buildings and quite right now with COVID and the pandemic, there were many individuals that retired early. Uh, there were many individuals that decided they wanted a different line of business. 